special learner that enables a computer to think for itself. The breakthrough came here, where a team of MIT scientists created what people are already calling a super brain. Didn't you teach at MIT? Actually, I worked on the project that they were talking about. He let their computer around the internet as a test, and it shut down hundreds of websites apparently it didn't like. The FBI has closed the MIT lab. This regulation prohibits the sale and distribution of the software elements that went into this computer. What if you gave that computer access to every book, news article, research paper, letter, blog, and posting on the internet, everything you can find? Could it answer the single most important question that humans have ever had? Is there evidence in any of it for God? Evidence that there is some kind of spiritual underpinning to life? Uh, yes, it could answer. Uh, attempt an answer. And when my wife was killed, I thought, what am I supposed to think about God after something like that? You really think this computer can say something new? It can see things that we can't possibly see. You have MIT's program and a good enough computer. I could ask the question. We should lock ourselves in. I don't want to risk being seen. But if we do get caught, it's my lab, so it's my responsibility, and I take the blame. No. I want to be a part of it. And I want it known I was a part of it. It's history, huh? I'll take my chance. Don't call me again, though. Don't contact me. He said he was from the FBI. You know, it's a crime to lie to a federal agent. But if this computer actually does get an answer, yes, or no, or something in between, we'd be, we'd be immortal names in science. Ready? Alpha.